All right, question of the day. Golf carts on 30A. What do you think about these? Should they be allowed? Should they not be allowed? I mean, they are allowed now, but I want to know in a perfect world, what would you like to see happen? I want you to write it in the comments. I know it's a total loaded question because we can't not allow them. You know, I mean, technically they're, um, what do they call low speed vehicle, low speed vehicles? You know, they're, they're technically legal cars because they've got a license tag and we're limited as, you know, as a county commission. I mean, that's really not our jurisdiction. However, county commissioners, you know, you, you know, if you're creative, you can suggest things to other departments or, you know, you can present better solutions for it, you know, or educational programs of explaining people why they shouldn't do something. Or, hey, should we, should we be promoting more golf carts? I mean, they are smaller. They're electric. You know, they're quieter. Um, I actually, personally, I don't have a problem with golf carts. What I have a problem with is I have a problem with the 12-year-olds driving them. You know, that, that you know, and, and that comes down to parenting, pure and simple. Like that, that's some of these issues, man, I mean, I, I don't, you know, all we can do is just hope that the people who come here, you know, are better parents and they don't let their 12 year old drive a golf cart. Cause you see that, I mean, you know what I'm talking about. You see that all the time. And that's another thing we're limited to, you know, you can look at someone and you can, you know, we can assume that they're not 16, but at the same time, you know, you can't pull them over just cause they look young. So it's, you know, it's one of those, interesting problems you know that we got to figure out what to do about it but sometimes the the the, the clear answer is not there um, and from what I understand we don't really have any rational jurisdiction to to not allow it as, as you know as a county like for the office that I'm running for I mean I, I don't think there's some like we could motion to not allow golf carts um, you know if you get there's always ways if you get creative you could probably tie it into um, the rentals of it, you know, you could, um, you know, you could regulate the businesses, you could regulate the, the rental properties if they're supplying them. But as far as like the actual vehicle itself, you know, I think we're kind of limited, but who knows, maybe they, what I always suggest to people is look at what they do in other areas. You know, we're not the only area that has golf carts, you know, and there's probably another area that they found a way to regulate it, if it was becoming a problem. Like I said, I wanna know if you think it's a problem. Might not be a problem, we might just not be used to it. Because like I said, it is smaller, it's a smaller vehicle, it takes up less space. And hey, they're like natural speed bumps basically, you know, because they, they keep traffic going slower. And do we really want traffic on 38 going faster? I mean, there's an argument that we don't. Anyways, write it in the comments. Tell me what you think. Ready, go.